this this is just a quick check in on hexagons non-triangulated hexagons versus triangulated ones so this is the way everyone perceives polygons just with edges but if it's as all geometry is um, a kind of a vector geometry where you have vertices that are actually dynamic and you have vectors that come connect them then what you have here is um, transformative just as the square would be there's no I mean this has a bit of a um, yeah it's a bit more stable maybe than squares but it is inherently unstable because it's non non triangulated um, and if you see hexagons that are stable then you have some sort of micro triangulation micro triangulation in the corners in the vertices to actually have a stable hexagon lattice you need the triangulation okay so this is a good example of magnetism going whatever way it wants great yeah but this is um a whole lot more stable okay I, apparently i messed up the the uh, um magnet magnet lines magnet field in this if you have such a complex magnet you can push some of the magnets into the other way which are with which they don't want to go yeah anyway so this is um you see apart from the one part jumping out here all the time where i messed up the pattern integrity this whole thing is much more stable and able to actually hold its shape than the non-triangulated one this can still move um, flexibly around all kinds of corners and bends and this is the way that um, you know the graphene layers behave and stuff it is incredibly stable in that way you cannot change much about the, the layer itself but the layer itself is flexible um, but it is necessary to see that in order for this to be structural and stable in that sense within a dynamic system as the cosmos is there needs to be some sort of triangulation in there and yes the triangles and the hexagons are very closely related as they both come from one another one way or the other but to say a hexagon in itself is a stable matter isn't really correct can't be it's everything that is not triangulated is non-stable yeah so much